So welcome back to Ego, the skill provider. And I'm very much excited for today's class. You know why? Because I am going to teach you a very new concept. It's a brand new concept. And this is perhaps the, uh, you know, the topic that has been least discussed. People don't discuss this kind of topic most of the time, you know, because, you know, uh, but, but believe me, this topic is going to make you or break you. That means it has tremendous impact on your spoken English skill, right? So today the topic is something called collocation, okay? So let me tell you something, my friends. It is something called collocation. This is, uh, I think, uh, all the senior guys, they know it. But still, this is completely new topic for you guys. So I'm going to teach you something called collocation. So what do you mean by collocation? So before I can tell you something called collocation, let me bring some myth before you. There is something called myth and reality. I believe we discussed it yesterday. But I am not talking about that myth. I am talking about some different myths. Most people think, let me tell you a little bit in Oriya, so most people think that I know grammar, so I can speak English. That's a myth. It's not the reality. Because your grammar knowledge is not going to decide whether you can speak English or not. Even knowing a lot of grammar, first time interaction, I inform everybody. Each and everybody who are before me right now, and what was that? So that was the, the concept was like this: the uh, spoken English my grammar not required. So I always, you know, uh, uh, you might be thinking, sir, how without grammar, how can I speak English? So today I'm going to prove that. Today I, we are going to prove, we all going to prove something called grammar is not an essential part of spoken English. Okay. So what exactly I'm going to do, I am going to teach you something called collocation, right? So before I can give you a lot of examples before that, let me write a single sentence. The sentence is like this. I am doing a lot of mistakes. In my spoken English, I am doing a lot of mistake in my spoken English. This is the sentence I have written it. And uh, I believe uh, some of the, uh, like, you know, the old guys, like Nodur veterans were with me for more than three months. So I request everybody just, uh, just uh, check it out. But I ask all the new joinees, just like Bhavani Shar, Suryakan Shar, Jadav Shar, like a lot of Devjani Madam, a lot of new people are there with me. So I want to know whether is there any grammatical mistake with the sentence? Upon either is a grammatical mistake, pouch on thinking. Look, this this is completely an interactive session. Just enjoy the lesson. Iti Sri Ma'am and also Jayanti Ma'am is there. So upon either is a mistake, pouch on thinking grammatical. I'm talking about grammar. Is there any grammatical mistake you guys are trying to notice from here? Upon which grammatical mistake, pouch on thicky, Jadi is Kalmate Kuntu. I'm doing a lot of mistakes in my spoken English. Eight a monogram sentence talikili. So, my question is that Are you getting any grammatical mistake? Upon either grammatical mistake spot, Kurchantiki, can you find any grammatical mistakes? Yes, you can inform me. Making doing the meeting, hey, Bale. I have. I'm no, no, no. You, you are, I have making. I have making. No, no. You are not getting mine. Move. What one is sentence? Ta likhi liu. Forget. We don't try. Try to change the sentence. You are not getting my point. Apno jani chodi koshne ta make kori apni. Move kori ke make kahi kori be. Why? Why it is a required for make? My question is that a thera apno kisi grammatical pause chundi ke. Are you getting any grammatical mistake, everybody? No, no, sir. Okay. No, sir. Um, no. Others sir, like a lot of the like, like mistakes like la. Like. Huh? Oh, mistake or mistakes? Hello. A lot of mistakes. Ha, sir, sir, lot of feel like that. Nah. Lot of money, kono. Lot of money, one good. More, more than one. That's a lot of. Proch, like, yeah. Sir, no? oh, yes. 
grammatically errors are kichu nahi sir no no i know sir you know i am talking about the new guys i know you can answer that so my question is that to jadab sir uh, bhavani sir like tisri ma'am others and uh, i know that ashok sir and other the, the, like um, uh, mukti kan sir they know you know that the answer you know so i don't want to ask you i'll ask you some other things but here this is a you know uh, questions to all the new joiners apan kon to ethre kichu mistake pau chanti ki are you getting bhavani sir are you getting any mistake apan kichu pau chanti mistake ethre no fine look this is completely a grammatically correct sentence This is absolutely grammatically correct sentence. But my dear friends, जब दिमु कोई बेटा उटे grammatically correct sentence, grammatically grammatically correct. ठीके mute कर दूँ समझते everybody please. कारण मुझे अबे a system पकेर नहीं. I'm away from the systems. I request everybody please mute it and check it out. देखों तू. I am doing a lot of mistakes in my spoken English. This is something called a grammatically correct sentence. I am a grammatically correct sentence. I am a chemistry channel because we are trying to translate it. I am a translation college. That is, if you are going to do a broadcast, you are going to understand the good things that the most spoken English are on a good things that they are doing. Right? You are going to do a good job. I am doing a work. मु अनेक जिन सब भूल कर छी आई एम डूइंग मिस्टेक्स लाइक दैट यू आर आई एम डूइंग अ लॉट ऑफ मिस्टेक्स इन माय स्पोकन इंग्लिश सो दिस इज अ ग्रामेटिकली करेक्ट सेंटेंस आई बिलीव देयर इज नथिंग कॉल्ड एनी ग्रामर ग्रामर वले बुछंती हमर एक पार्ट ऑफ स्पीच हो देन सब्जेक्ट वर्ब एग्रीमेंट हो लाइक नो देयर इज नो बट दिस सेंटेंस इज कंप्लीटली रॉन्ग दिस सेंटेंस इज कंप्लीटली रॉन्ग एंड व्हेयर इज स्ट्रांग हियर समथिंग कॉल्ड डूइंग And here mistakes. Whenever I say doing mistake, I cannot say I am doing mistake. I am supposed to write I am. What is the correction? This is the wrong things. Okay, this is completely wrong things. I I, I, I make yes. mistake now, Baki. Yes, I am. Yes. I am making a lot of mistake. mistakes in my spoken english right now the twist don't or the twist doesn't end here there is some another twist so i want to tell you my friends i am making mistake why i am making mistake why should i write i am making mistake अपन टे ओडिया कथा मन पकांतु मु गोटे करूची काम करिया को मैं डू बोली कोंती मेक मन री करिवा आई एम मेकिंग टी आई एम आई एम बिल्डिंग अ हाउस लाइक दैट मेक इज समथिंग कॉल्ड यू आर ट्राइंग टू मेक समथिंग आउट ऑफ इट बट हियर आई एम मेकिंग अ मिस्टेक्स ए सेंटेंस अ सुनला परे अपन गुटी का ऑकवर्ड फील होतो एवरीबॉडी द न्यू गाइस और सर एमती काई हला व्हाई लेट मी गिव यू द आंसर लुक आई एम डूइंग मिस्टेक इन माय स्पोकन इंग्लिश इट looks absolutely perfect to all the non native speaker please mark it down for non native speaker look what i am going to do today is the introduction class once you understand the introduction class fully what i'll do i'll bring the screen for tomorrow from tomorrow onwards i'm going to teach you through the screen like sharing all the things will happen but this is the things i want to completely devote one hour with you just to explain the concept understanding apan ko gote jinsho mo like you know most of the time telling in oriya i'm speaking in oriya you know why because man rakhi thantu like e jo jinsho ta apan use korchanti right now you are trying to use it let me tell you it is going to help in many ways the concept is very important so here i want to i am making a lot of mistakes in my spoken english eta jo koile i am doing a lot of mistakes that appears correct that appears very much correct to non native speaker first try to understand what is native speaker what is non native speaker suppose everybody speak oriya 
ଆପଣ ମାନେ ସମସ୍ତେ ଓଡ଼ିଆ କହୁଛନ୍ତି ସୋ ଉଇ ଅଲ୍ ଆର୍ କଲ୍ଡ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ଅଫ ଓଡିଶା ଅର ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ଅଫ ଦିସ ଲାଙ୍ଗୁଏଜ ତେଣୁ ଆମର ଯଦି ମାତୃଭାଷା ଯେଉଁଟା ଉଇ ଆର ଦ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ସେମିତି ଜଣେ ବଙ୍ଗାଳୀ ଲୋକ ଲାଇକ ନୋ ସେ କହିବେ ଯେ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ଅଫ ବଙ୍ଗାଳୀ ବେଙ୍ଗାଲୀ ରାଇଟ ସୋ ଲାଇକ ଦାଟ ଏକ୍ଜାକ୍ଟଲି ସୋ ଉଇ ଆର ଦ ନନ୍ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ଦିସ ଇଜ ନଟ ଆ ମଦର ଟଙ୍ଗ ସୋ ଇଟ ଲୁକ୍ସ ପରଫେକ୍ଟଲି ଓକେ ଫର୍ସ ଦାଟ ଓକେ ଫାଇନ ଆଇ ଏମ ଡୁଇଙ୍ଗ ମିଷ୍ଟେକ ଆପଣ ଟ୍ରାନ୍ସଲେସନ ଟା ନା ପୁରା ସହଜରେ କରିଦଉଛନ୍ତି ହଁ ମୁଁ ଏଠି ମିଷ୍ଟେକ କରୁଛି ତ ଆଇ ଏମ ଡୁଇଙ୍ଗ ମିଷ୍ଟେକ ବାସ କରେକ୍ଟ ସାର ଏକଦମ ଥମ୍ସ ଅପ ବଟ ହିୟର ଟେକ ଇଟ ଆଉଟ ଫ୍ରମ ଦ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ପଏଣ୍ଟ ଅଫ ଭିଉ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ମାନେ ଯେଉଁଠି ଏଇଟା ହେଉଛି ମାତୃଭାଷା ରାଇଟ ବେସିକାଲି ଆମେ ଦୁଇଟା ନେଉଛନ୍ତି ୱାନ ଇଜ କଲ ଆମେରିକାନ ଇଂଲିଶ ଅଦର ଇଜ କଲ ବ୍ରିଟିଶ ଇଂଲିଶ ସୋ ଆମେରିକାନ ପିପଲ ଆଣ୍ଡ ବ୍ରିଟିଶ ପିପଲ ଦେ ଟେନ ଟୁ ୟୁଜ ସମଥିଙ୍ଗ କଲ ମେକ ମିଷ୍ଟେକ ତ ଆପଣ କହିବେ ସାର ସେମାନେ କାହିଁକି ମେକ ମିଷ୍ଟେକ କରନ୍ତି ବିକଜ ଦାଟ ଇଜ ଦ ନ୍ୟାଚୁରାଲ କମ୍ବିନେସନ ଫର ଏ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ମେକ ପ୍ଲସ ମିଷ୍ଟେକ ଇଜ ଏ ନ୍ୟାଚୁରାଲ କମ୍ବିନେସନ ତ ହିୟର ମେକ ପ୍ଲସ ମିଷ୍ଟେକ ଇଜ ସମଥିଙ୍ଗ କଲ୍ଡ ଏ ନ୍ୟାଚୁରାଲ କମ୍ବିନେସନ ଆଣ୍ଡ ଦାଟ ଇଜ କଲ୍ଡ କଲ ଲୋକେସନ ତ କଲ ଲୋକେସନ ଇନ ଏ ନଟ ସେଲ ଆଇ ୱୁଡ ଲାଇକ ଟୁ ଇନଫର୍ମ ୟୁ ମାଇ ଫ୍ରେଣ୍ଡସ ଇଟ ଇଜ ଅ ନ୍ୟାଚୁରାଲ କମ୍ବିନେସନ ଅଫ ଟୁ ୱାର୍ଡସ ତ ନେଟିଭ ସ୍ପିକର ୟୁଜ when ever that speak that particular language ta mane odia re kahiya bolle jetale native speaker use karanti tanka language ta ko se mane eta natural process re bahar ame jemti gote hotha to odia amaro patru bahari pade sabu jinsa re apan kichu bhabanti ni exactly ame translation kala amaro do mistake ta hot bahare but for them make mistake make mistake make mistake like that so here this is something called make mistake so if you say do mistake let me write it for you do plus mistake this is a wrong combination make mistake this is a correct combination so this combination is called collocation so collocation is something called it is a natural way of combining two words whenever trying to speak a language by the native speaker that is something called this is called native speaker native speaker okay so this is something called the native speaker this is how the native speaker speak english and let me tell you my friends apan jo manankar gote bhanto dharana thila you have a wrong notion that translation is important something called uh, grammar is important tale grammar ethi apan ko dhoka dei dela the concept of something called grammar or translation completely i deceive you here pura dhoka de apan cheat kar dela apan se to apan ethi pura hari gale je actually apan ko jane kahibo sir actually uh, apan jodi grammar no janibe english koi pare ete kon gram apan to jani thile grammar jani chanti i am doing a lot of mistakes in my spoken english or i do i do a lot of mistakes in my spoken english or i have done a lot of mistakes in my spoken english or i have been doing a lot of mistakes in spoken english apan the tense time koi dele but still sentence ta kai wrong hela it's because of the fact that you did not collocate the sentence collocate the verb form this is the noun we are going to use naba process ସେ ନାଭା ପ୍ରୋସେସ ମୁଁ କହିବି ଗୋଟିଏ ୱାର୍ଡ ରୁ କେମିତି ଆପଣ ଚାରି ଚାରିଟା ୱାର୍ଡ ବାହାର କରିବେ ସମଥିଂ କଲ୍ ଲେଟ୍ ମି ଗିଭ୍ ଏନ୍ ଏକ୍ଜାମ୍ପଲ ସପୋଜ ଆମେ କହୁଛେ କମ୍ୟୁନିକେଟ କମ୍ୟୁନିକେସନ କମ୍ୟୁନିକେଟିଭ କମ୍ୟୁନିକେଟିଭଲି ଡେଷ୍ଟ୍ରକ୍ସନ ଡେଷ୍ଟ୍ରୟ ଡେଷ୍ଟ୍ରକ୍ଟିଭ ଡେଷ୍ଟ୍ରକ୍ଟିଭଲି ଲାଇକ୍ ଲଟ୍ ଅଫ ଥିଙ୍ଗସ ଆଦେ ସୋ ଦାଟ ଇଜ କଲ୍ଡ ନାଭା ପ୍ରୋସେସ ଆଇ ଏମ ଗୋଇଂ ଟୁ ଇଣ୍ଟ୍ରୋଡ୍ୟୁସ ଫର ୟୁ ଯେମିତି ଆମେ ଗୋଟେ ଗୋଟେ ଛୋଟିଆ ଛୋଟିଆ ଆମେ ୱାର୍ଡ କହୁଛନ୍ତି ଏସବିଏଲ ଟେକ୍ନିକ you don't find here if you search in google also you never find it because this is our own creation exactly i am going to give you a process called nava process where from using one word you can create a lot of words and can speak english in four different ways that's just like to empower you guys okay so right now come to the point so it hai gote jinsa grammatically correct thile madhya collocation bhul hoi gale apan kar english bhul hoi jauchi so jodi apan kar i am doing a lot of mistakes for a non native speaker non native speaker just like indians this is not a mother tongue so that appears very much correct bhavani sir kabhi yes sir it's very much correct mate kichhi lagu ni itish madam kabhi yes sir thik achi 
lot of people jada sir bhavani sir aur suryakant sir everybody do as before me they will say yeah very much correct sir ithar kichu bhul mu pauni because mu jaha bhi knowledge achi mor mu apply karuche mu apply kari ki pauche everything is correct and why did you say that it's wrong i did not say it's wrong sir it is as per the collocation to mu jo apan ko speaking pyramid dekhai chi prathame kon achi the bottom of the pyramid something called structure I mean the structure कर देले tens time all the things I am going to give you जब भी collocation ना जाने में structure का value टाइप ही कौन रहेगा इट इस अमूर्त structure कर चंदी but इट इस wrong ही जाऊँ जी तो माने collocation is very important to speak error free English something called error free English ये ये English टा हो जी this is not error free this is full of errors अपन माने चाऊँ चंदी पुणी आउ थे पुणी भूल करिया पे नेवर आई विल नॉट मेक इट हैपन एट लीस्ट विथ मी आई डोंट वांट टू मेक इट हैपन सो आई जस्ट वांट टू टेल यू दिस इज कॉल्ड एरर ऑफ इंग्लिश आई एम मेकिंग अ लॉट ऑफ मिस्टेक आई हैव बीन मेकिंग अ लॉट ऑफ मिस्टेक्स इन स्पोकन इंग्लिश दैट्स कॉल्ड द राइट कोलोकेशन एंड दिस इज समथिंग कॉल्ड राइट कोलोकेशन दिस इज कॉल्ड मेक मिस्टेक दैट इज कॉल्ड बाय नेटिव स्पीकर दैट्स हाउ नेटिव स्पीकर नेटिव स्पीकर कहली जोठे इंग्लिश ता होची मातृभाषा That's their mother tongue. Let me give an example. Like we we are following two English. One is called American English, or there is called British English. And both the people use the same collocation. Make mistake. In the American culture, do mistake. Upon approach, do close to ninety nine percent. That is okay. Okay, it is okay because they don't know collocation. Our collocation, upon fool, can be then that is something broken English. that's something called error full english it is completely full of errors and i don't want you should make this mistake you should make this mistake in your life so that's why collocation is very very important yes or no yes or no my friends tell me yes or no yes sir can you tell me everybody like lot of people are there collocation is important or not for you yes sir yes sir yes sir yes sir if you don't know if you don't know collocation to apan kemti english koi म्यूट कर दियो तोबे राइट नाउ टेल मी इफ यू आर नॉट गोइंग टू लर्न समथिंग कॉल्ड कोलोकेशन हाउ एग्जैक्टली आर गोइंग टू स्पीक इंग्लिश आउ जदी अपन इंग्लिश कहिबे एंती अपन एरर रहिबो इट एरर रहिबो तो अपन को मु चाहि मिनी जे अपन एरर एठो पुनी एगि गोरु जाई कि अपन जदी पुनी एरर युक्त इंग्लिश कहिबे दैट्स प्रेटेक्ट फॉर यू दैट इज बैड फॉर इक्वली फॉर मी बिकॉज़ आई एम द ट्रेनर एंड अपन मोठर पडी जाई कि मार्केट रे अपन का रेपो खराब करले So I am partially, or I am fully responsible for that, and I don't want you should not, you know, face this kind of defeat in the market. So, sethi pay mu apun ko error free English padiya pay mu collocation apun ko padi. So right now it's very interesting that ita to apun kichhi kichhi matra bhuji porthiye. Let me give you another example. Now this is clear. You can take a screenshot if anybody wants to take it. You can take it because I want to erase it. But believe me, all the things I am going to give you in the slide. When we are coming for the uh, tomorrow, we are coming for the entire things. I now make pure specifically jiba one by one, one by lesson, one sir jiba. Say somewhere all the things will be there. But since this is something that I am trying to explain you everything, so you can just for your understanding, you can take the screenshot. Then I have to erase it. Clear? Great. Fine. So right now, something called okay. So this is something called collocation. So what do you mean collocation? Collocation is something called naturally adding two different words. So what they have done? Because you have English written in the English. So you have written in 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 English. नेचुरल इंग्लिश कोन दे कहली नेचुरल इंग्लिश मान दिस इज कॉल्ड नेचुरल इंग्लिश आई एम मेकिंग मिस्टेक यू बिकम अ नेचुरल स्पीकर आई एम डूइंग मिस्टेक एरर किंतु आपण धरि परिबे कोन पई ना आपण ग्रामर धरि बस यू फील ग्रामर इज एवरीथिंग एंड पीपल से ग्रामर इज द बाइबल फॉर इंग्लिश बट वी हैव प्रूव इट रॉन्ग माय फ्रेंड्स ग्रामर इज नॉट द बाइबल ऑफ इंग्लिश इट इज द कोलोकेशन दैट मैटर्स द मोस्ट whenever there is a fight between collocation and grammar we will win the battle obviously collocation so that's why collocation is my favorite subject and that is my also favorite topic and i will make you a superstar in spoken english people have already 
uh, soon all these things and you guys are going to see it also you can speak non stop english without any problem and in norsel i want to tell you collocation is the self rectification process apana nijuguni te rectify kariya pai dekhantu apana eta jani chanti jodi apana jani thibe dekhantu a lot of people like amaro mukti kan sare ka jani chanti they have attended some of my classes to so, seman dekhile je na sare eta make ho bai thi so that is a rectification process से जानी छंदी आई एम डूइंग मिस्टेक रॉन्ग होबो आई एम मेकिंग मिस्टेक करेक्ट हो कोन पई होबो बिकॉज ऑफ कोलोकेशन सो लेट्स ट्राई टू अंडरस्टैंड कोलोकेशन लिटिल बिट मोर आउ टू के डिटेल्स रे पढिबा ओके सो आई एम गोइंग टू इरेज दिस वन सो आई बिलीव एवरीबॉडी इज एंजॉयिंग राइट और इट्स बोरिंग फॉर यू गाइस इट्स एंजॉयिंग आर यू बोरिंग और यू फील बोरिंग और समथिंग एंजॉय आई डोंट नो बट यू नो दिस इज वन ऑफ द फाइनेस्ट टॉपिक ओके सो लेट मी गिव अनदर एग्जांपल Okay, this questions to questions to all the new guys. Okay, not to old guys. Do you find any mistake? All the old guys, new guys. I want to give a suggestion. It is Rima. Just check it out and tell me whether any mistake. We are finding in the. Do you find any mistake in these particular things? I want to give a suggestion. Suppose empty mode sentence coil. Do you find any mistake? Sir, uh, sir, grammatical जी तो किसी भी mistake नहीं. तो grammatical mistake नहीं तो okay fine that's that's exactly I want to know. Okay fine mute कर दियो तो others जदाब sir um Babani sir. A lot of people are there. Okay, fine. No, so can... no mistake only. No mistake. Yes, no mistake. Okay, fine. So that is means from the non-dentist speaker. Sir, make suggestion over there. Yes. Yeah. Tell me. Sir, make like. No, no. The give a suggestion or make a suggestion. Forget about this, Madam. Who can't go into it actually? I just, upon this mistake, they could change. Mistake, I mean, they could change. So that is from the collocation point of view. I'm talking about in grammar mistake. So this is called non-native speaker. But actually, this is completely wrong. And I want to make a suggestion. and this is called native speaker like that i want to make a suggestion in this particular thing and this is something called collocation make suggestion make plus suggestion make suggestion so that is something called that is called collocation this is something called collocation so that is you can say i want to make a suggestion but apan sadal kon ko chhi i want to give a suggestion more दबापाई चाहे तो ट्रांसलेसन देखो तो कमी ट्रांसलेसन आपको पूरा मानते के कदर्ज कर रखी फास्ट कथा है मत गोटे गोटे पैसा दि गिव मी सम मनी रईट गिव मी सम मनी आई वांट टू गिव यू आलम्स आई वांट टू गिव यू समथिंग आई वांट टू गिव यू सजेसन देखो के ट्रांसलेसन प्रोसेस मो माइंड टाइम पूरा कैप्चर कर रखी एंड लुक ट्रांसलेसन प्रोसेस मिस्टेक कर आई वांट टू गिव ए सजेसन मुझे सजेसन दबापी चाहूँगी fine that's very mu kichi daba pai chau i want to give you something mu e pen te daba pai chau i want to give this pen jodi ei ta hai gala obviously jemti mu koi thili baba asundi father is coming barsha asuchi rain is coming bas over and that's called mistake and without knowing the mistake you are making mistake every day every day every day and it is piling up and suddenly you find yourself in a difficult situation and telling the sorry sir इंग्लिश सर कोई पर नर्वस सर नर्वस नर्वस बी ना जानू ना कोटी मिस्टेक मिस्टेक कर Or there is called mistake. Mistake you are supposed to know, but error you don't know. So you are, this is called error for you. 
ए जो एरर टक केमति रेक्टिफाई करे दैट्स मोर थिंग्स लेट मी लीव टेक लिटिल बिट मोर आल्सो ओके आउ टिके ताको इंटरेस्टिंग करबा आई एम जस्ट यू नो ट्राइंग टू गिव यू ऑल द पॉसिबल एंगल्स वेयर कोलोकेशन प्लेज अ वेरी इंपोर्टेंट रोल सेटिंग ऑफ योर कम्युनिकेशन स्किल इफ यू वांट टू स्पीक नॉन स्टॉप इंग्लिश नेचुरल इंग्लिश एरर फ्री इंग्लिश टू स्पीक इंग्लिश कॉन्फिडेंटली एंड टू स्पीक इंग्लिश फ्लुएंटली यू नीड कोलोकेशन collocation podiveni you are trying to bypass this mistake or you are trying to bypass this step i am sorry to say guys you cannot speak english and there will be problems throughout your life so i don't want to make this happens for you as long as you are with me i want to clear that particular things for for you okay so don't worry you are with me you are in the safe hand you can trust the process you can count on me i am here to guide you how to speak the four parameters error of english how to speak english confidently how to speak english fluently and how to speak english naturally become a natural speaker that means a gifted speaker that means a native speaker it doesn't matter it doesn't matter where you are you are from barampur i am from kotak he is from kendrapara doesn't matter everybody can in this platform can speak english naturally just like a native speaker the way a native speaker is speaking you can speak the same way pretty easy i'll make it happen my friends just wait and see okay so something called collocation let me give another example okay let me give another example please give importance to spoken english this is my first example and the second one i would like to inform you our sentence lekuchi please okay so two sentences i have listed it here one is called please give importance to spoken english please give attention to spoken english importance attention in a sense apan ko bhi data ka same but let me tell you my friends jo data sentence likhi the ko sentence sa theek ko sentence bhul or both are wrong or both are correct can anybody can tell me two sentence i have written for you this is we are learning something called collocation a very important aspect of your spoken english or believe me ताको सर के ही पढांती नि काई कि नाय कांसेप्ट सेमती थाय तन याकु समस्त कोलोकेशन कोटी पढा जाय नि मोस्ट इफ यू चेक आउट एनी ऑफ द थिंग्स यू आस्क देम कोलोकेशन और लास्ट कोटी के पढे व्हाई दिस इज मोर इंपोर्टेंट देन ग्रामर दिस इज एक्ट एज ए ग्रामर आ एटा आपण यदि न पढबे आपण इंग्लिश करेक्टली कहिबे किंती लुक यू कैन फाइंड अ लॉट ऑफ मिस्टेक्स हियर लुक गिव प्लीज गिव इंपोर्टेंस टू स्पोकन इंग्लिश प्लीज गिव अटेंशन टू स्पोकन कोटे ठीक अछि ना दीटा को भूल अछि ना दीटा को ठीक अछि कैन एनीवन कैन टेल मी Please speak it up, guys. Sir, give attention. Give attention. Bula, give attention. Bula, bula, bula. Sir, quote, quote, sir, quote, quote. First one, number. Data ko bolo chhu, okay. One and two. One and two, both are wrong, okay. Five. Any other question? Any other answer? Come on, guys. Please speak it up. Any more wrong? Like no. Somebody told me like no. Both are wrong. So is it true? Is both are wrong or both are correct? let me tell you i don't want to confuse more you all guys look here please give importance is correct whereas give attention is wrong so you say why why sir what happens why happens like let me tell you my friends here give plus importance is a natural collocation this is a natural collocation but give plus attention is not the natural collocation that is called pay attention yeah. so look at the sentence the second sentence born terrible wrong ame kon kouche ame thik kouche so do you understand why are exactly you standing my friends to apan jodi mane karo jo mane ebe bhi bhabu chanti je actually mu apan ko prathama ru kahe जे एक्चुअली ग्रामर इज नॉट एन एसेंशियल पार्ट ऑफ स्पोकन इंग्लिश मु आपन को गोटे गोटे जगह प्रूफ करिक देखौछ 
आपण ग्रामर जाणी ग्रामर एटा किती भूल नाही बट कलोकेशन भूल होती तर ग्रामर पडवा ना कलोकेशन पडवा प्लीज टेल मी एव्हरीबडी ग्रामर पडवी ना कलोकेशन पडवी आपण कुहत मते आय वॉन्ट टू लिसन फ्रॉम यू गाईज जदि आपण कहे नाही सर कलोकेशन पडत ग्रामर पडवी आय टीच यू ग्रामर फॉर स्पोकन इंग्लिश लॉट ऑफ पीपल आर मिस गाईडिंग द युथ दे आर टेलिंग ग्रामर 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 आय हॅव सीन लॉट ऑफ युट्यूब चॅनेल वेअर दे ओनली हायलाइट फॉल्स थिंग्स ग्रामर पडाय सर मग आपण बी मते कहले सर मोठे ग्रामर लेच नाही दॅट्स वाय आय कॅन स्पीक इंग्लिश डू यू नो दॅट ग्रामर इज इम्पॉर्टंट और कलोकेशन इज इम्पॉर्टंट एव्हरीबडी प्लीज कॅन आय हॅव द आन्सर फ्रॉम यू गाईज कलोकेशन इज इम्पॉर्टंट कलोकेशन इज मोर इम्पॉर्टंट दॅन ग्रामर कलोकेशन सर दॅट्स वॉट दॅट्स वॉट exactly so that's why i told you from the very beginning that i don't want to teach grammar i'll teach you something collocation and collocation is in a syllabus ego syllabus re apan dekhi chanti je mu pratham jo amar pyramid structure apan pakare samastam bhai thibo am the bottom of the pyramid something lies what do you call it that is called the structure and the second point is called collocation and the third is vocabs and fourth is practice and the fifth one that is something called spoken english so this is the four things very easy and let me focus something called collocation so that's why i told you my friends grammar is not an essential part of spoken english grammar ta gote spoken english ra part nu he i don't know why and how this kind of misconception normally travels in the i mean all the false propaganda is happening everywhere grammar janno kemti english koibo पाठ ग्रामर या ग्रामर तो मुझे जानी थी भूल कर दूँ चेट अपन वन तो ग्रामर जान चंदी इटे भूल कर दूँ चुन तो ग्रामर जानी कौन लाव टेल मी दैट्स द थिंग्स माय फ्रेंड्स ट्राइ टू अंडरस्टैंड मीथ एंड रियलिटी मीथ क्यों चुन डे फॉल्स नोशन एंड व्हाट इज़ द रियलिटी ट्राइ टू एक्सेप्ट ट्राइ टू � पढ़ी that is going to help in two ways one is called spoken english or there is called written english got it ma'am so it doesn't matter whether you are dealing with a spoken english or uh, written english for both the things we are supposed to know something called collocation mane dhoranto apan gote jan ko lekhi pathau chanti you can say please pay attention to this work while trying to speak also tell the same things to me please pay attention to this one also so whether it is written communication or spoken english in both ways you guys are using collocation that's what i am going to tell i don't discredit grammar let me tell you once more apan bhavuthe mor kichi grammar prati gote mane kharap mane i have a real dislike no no it's not like that try to understand my point i love grammar very much kai namo written class bhi nauchi and i love it very much jo teacher sir mane madam man nauchun se mane bhi janchanti how i make this class very you know very interesting so it doesn't matter to mu kahiwa katha actually we are using wrong tools at the wrong time mu apan koi thili spoken english and written english re bahut kodai taratamya achi ame kon koruchanti gote galat rastare jai ki ame bhavucha ame english kahi parna kemti kahibe apan apan grammar dhari ki english kahibe ki apan collocation dhari ki english kahiwa dakar apan to be kahutile give importance and give him attention attention mote dio give me attention dio give attention that's a problem kai na attention se to na jibani pay attention ho okay so let me give another example suppose let me give an another example suppose we know there are so many words are there like you no know, daily basis re apan use korchan let me give some words one is called speed post this is the first first post express train let me give the three different words acha speed mane fast fast mane express you know quick or you can you can say you know quick meal
फोर डिफरेन्ट वर्ड्स आई हाव गिवेन यू माइ फ्रेंड्स आपण देखतो चारिटा डिफरेंट वर्ड्स म दे छि आपण समस्त परिचित मे बी यू आर नॉट एक्सप्रेस विथ दिस वन लेट मी एक्सप्लेन यू फर्स्ट अ स्पीड पोस्ट दैट व्हेनेवर यू आर ट्राइंग टू डेलीवर सम मेल वेरी क्विकली सो देयर इज समथिंग कॉल्ड स्पीड पोस्ट यू आर सपोज टू पे एक्स्ट्रा नॉर्मल आई लाइक नो मेल थारो सेटा जल्दी आसे आपण जान छथि एवरीबॉडी इज अवेयर ऑफ दैट सो आई एम नॉट सपोज टू एक्सप्लेन दैट वन फास्ट फूड शाल आई एक्सप्लेन इट नो बिकॉज यू नो बेटर देन मी एक्सप्रेस मेल आई शुड नॉट एक्सप्लेन इट यू नो दैट एक्सप्रेस टेन कोन क्विक मेल लो क्विक मेल माने कोन सर देखंतो फॉर एग्जांपल लाइक नो भवानी सर करबे ऑफिस टाइम हे गेलानी तो भवानी सर कोन करछन मामा को मागु छन इसके नि जल्दी तो भवानी सर कर खाइबार गोटे बडे टाइम था एवरीबॉडी सपोज आई टेक हाफ एन आवर इट्स गुड और बैड आई डोंट नो बट आई टेक अ लॉन्गर टाइम व्हाइल ईटिंग सो मोस्ट पीपल हैव दैट बैड हैबिट आई डोंट नो व्हेदर इट बैड और गुड बट हैबिचुअली आई हैव बीन यू नो टेकिंग अ लॉन्गर टाइम व्हेन आई विल टेक सपोज मु हाफ एन आवर खाउची किंतु मते आज एमती गोटे ऑफिस बार अछि मो सेटा 15 मिनिट रे खाइली त माने टाइम टा मोर कमी गला दैट इज कॉल्ड अ क्विक मील आई हैव अ क्विक मील माने मन इच्छा जाय समटाइम्स इट हैपेंस टू विथ एवरीबॉडी आपण जानि छथि किछि किछि टाइम आपण को माने टाइम आपण को एमती कर दिय जे उटा आपण खाइबाटा जल्दी कर दियंती नॉर्मल वे रे हुए नी आपण जस्ट लाइक यू नो यू जस्ट हैव समथिंग लाइक दैट मामा पार्टी करथु आपण लाइक नो व्हाई यू नॉट इटिंग नो नो आई वांट टू गो लुक द टाइम इज ऑफ माय कलीग इज कॉलिंग बॉस विल बी कमिंग लाइक दैट यू गिव अ लॉट ऑफ एक्सक्यूजेस और समटाइम्स some uh, you know factors is forcing you go there so obviously you were simply you know quitting after after having anything so that is called a quick meal apan dekhantu speed fast express and quick having the same meaning shigro 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 odia re kouchi kintu dekhantu mu kahi paribi ki speed train kahi paribi can i say speed train no can i say speed meal no can i say quick post no this is called collocation this is called collocation jodi ei ta apan change kar pariben ni apan sei ta kin change kar debe are you getting my point everybody yes or no are you getting my point so this is something called yes, jodi jodi apan express food kahibe ki apan fast food no kahi ki jodi jada sar kar mor jau jodi you am friends am mate sar ke sa tik express food khaiwa mo to dori jibi express food sar kono सर जोडा फास्ट फूड कर ओ फास्ट फूड ओके तो लेट्स गो सो जदि सेटा ट्रू जदि हमें जान जे स्पीड माने जल्दी शीघ्र फास्ट माने मते जल्दी एक्सप्रेस माने जल्दी क्विक माने मते जल्दी जदि सब जल्दी 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 माने क्विकली हमें जो जदि बुझु छथि माने लेट टाइम रे काम होउ छी तले एडा को काई फिक्स हे कि रहि छी व्हाई कैन आई हैव द आंसर फ्रॉम यू यू नो यू हैव नो आंसर आपण कभी सर आगुरु अछि आगुरु किछ नै दिस इज कॉल्ड कोलोकेशन This is called collocation, my friends, and that's why if you are trying to change the pattern, it goes wrong. Whenever you are trying to change the pattern, sometimes it goes wrong. Look at the things. Express mail, it's a meaning, right? One, fast train, no meaning. Speed food, no meaning. Can you speed up? Abang, speed le, come kar, jaldi kar, jaldi kar, quick. Abang, ko chun, hurry up. Jaldi karo, yar, fast, fast, come fast, come fast. Ko chun. ता मीनिंग तो सेया होची बट आमे काई डिफरेंट ता माने कोला पोस्ट सहित केवल स्पीड लागि पेलो सो दैट इज कॉल्ड कॉल लोकेशन फूड सहित फास्ट लागि पारिबो दैट इज कॉल्ड कॉल लोकेशन आपण कहिबे नी जे न फास्ट ट्रेन फास्ट मील नथिंग देयर इज नथिंग कॉल्ड फास्ट मील सो दिस इज समथिंग कॉल्ड कॉल लोकेशन एंड इफ यू नो कॉल लोकेशन अच्छा वर्तमान एट चैलेंजेस आसीले कोन तो ए वला वर्ड तो अनेक जिनसा आपण जानि छथि यू नो अ लॉट ऑफ थिंग्स बट स्टिल how to use it in your day to day life that's a real challenge so we have a very quick i mean quick and easy solution for you so don't worry so apan bujhi pail everybody understood what is the meaning of collocation everybody can i can i get surekan sir jadav sir devjani ma'am everybody who are before me right now do you really understand yes, this sir. one everybody yes, so yes, this sir. is something called this is something called collocation ab matte ko do collocation is really important for you without collocation you cannot speak english so this something called very interesting things i want to 